Club 516 was the spot. That's what it was. It's been all type of crazy shit that it went on down there, bro. Like, um, I'm not gonna lie, I had a threesome one night and we already knew each other and she had her friend with her and I was just, I just asked her, like, man, tell your friend to come in here. Told her friend to come in here and get naked, dropped all her clothes and it was just popping after that. <laughs> it was just crazy, I'm telling you. Like, it's like just stuff like that happened. It just be so random. The ratio between like, Men and female was like just too crazy. It was like it was like way more females than males that some of the females just started leaving because it wasn't enough males to facilitate the party. Like it's man, it's crazy, bro. But now I'm out of there now. I got I had to move out and um, get another spot because incidents and things like that though. But um, five sixteen lives forever. <laughs> I actually do believe in aliens though. After seeing, what's that movie called? The Fifth Kind or something like that? And it's like some shit that be going on in Alaska. If I seen someone with some a big ass head and some big ass eyeballs running around this motherfucker, like, I don't know, shit, I wouldn't know what to do. I'm pretty sure wouldn't nobody know what to do. Probably shoot that motherfucker or something, but I don't think it's too far out though. I mean, if, if we hear something else is there, you know what I'm saying? I love my pets. I don't know about everybody else though, but I do love my pets. One dog, his name is Digital. That's the little white poodle, and the other dog is Max. Digital has been around forever. He got the real 516 vibe, you know what I'm saying? Digital know what it is over there. He, Digital ain't been drunk, high, everything. But Max, he he knew to the, he knew to the, uh, to the move. He, he kind of caught the swift end of it though. Max is like my son, Digital like my brother, <laughs> to be honest though, you know what I'm saying? Like, I can't really, you know, can't say what's my favorite dog in that situation because they both my dogs, you know what I'm saying? I haven't took mushrooms a gang of times though, but I do remember my very first time though. That shit was crazy, bro. That shit was amazing. I feel like I could figure out any math problem that you put in front of me. Like, it can be anything. X plus fucking 11,000 minus whatever. I, I, I got the answers. I felt like I was asleep, but my mind was like fully functional. Like, my body was just like all the way asleep. But if somebody would have just said, Sonny, I would have just popped right back up. Like, just like, it was like, it was like a computer, like how you have it shut down and you flip it back over this shit. That shit right back, oh, um, where you left it off it. That shit fucked your stomach up heavy though, so. I'm just gonna give y'all the heads up before you try it, man. Just you make sure you in the, in the vicinity of a bathroom somewhere, bro. Cause that shit'll fuck your stomach up in the middle in the middle of you having a great time, bro. It don't it ain't got no motherfucking pause. It's like it's time. You know what I'm saying? You gotta go. You gotta go, bro. For real. <laughs> See, my dad is Nigerian, but he had came to America, right? And like, he told people back home that he had children and everything here though. When I started getting successful and stuff, people really like, people didn't believe him because we had never came there. So when we got there though, it was kind of like, yo, they in town, they here. And the whole city, like we bro, like it was so many people like just coming, like really just to see me, just to see me and my brother to make sure we was real, you know what I'm saying? Like the culture shock was probably like, just really like the food though. You ain't got, you ain't got the simple necessities to like getting food. You got to really figure out what it is that you want to eat. You know what I'm saying? You can't just get out and be like, let me just drive around, see if I'm gonna find some shit though. It ain't like that. You got to know what you want, you know what I'm saying? But in uh, South Africa though, they did have a KFC out there. 